99 freaking things? I don't know. Let me double check. I got. Slots. I'm shocked that uh, Sam didn't delete me off of uh, Final Fantasy. Holy crap, dude. I got like 1,300 coins on this thing. Also, I'm, I'm shocked that certain people haven't removed me as well. And I'm like, why do you... Well, after she deleted me off Facebook, and then I fucking went off on her on uh, Snapchat, I'm surprised she didn't delete me. I got rid of Snapchat, Tinder, uh, freaking Plenty of Fish, eHarmony, um, OkCupid. I thought eHarmony was pay. It was. Uh, that's why I got rid of it. <laughs> And like it's it, it's become so freaking difficult to find something. Not too many people understand it. It's like when you're a drone, you're tethered to everything that you do on a day to day basis, whether you realize it or not. So in all like, uh, here's your problem, Junie. Wow. And I know exactly. I know. I know exactly what your problem is because I have the same problem. You don't have a problem finding chicks or talking to them. You have a problem finding the right one. Nah, uh, it's not. It ain't even that for me. Well, that too. That that coincides with it, and stuff. But that's not the 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 front end. The front end is still like approaching, like a certain setting, and at least finding someone, more or less. I'm at six sixty-seven. Okay. Sixty-seven? So, no, six fifty-seven. Oh. Like for example. If I were to go to, let's say, a bar, what business do I have at this bar? You know, I don't drink. I'm not that keen on talking to anybody really drunk because at that point, a conversation just feels a bit one-sided after a while. Like, the person will have less and less to say and they'll be slipping away, like, you know, subconsciously losing freaking rationality. Like, well, not even some kind of, like, inadvertently losing, uh, rationality. Like, whether they want and they to want to fuck. Nah. I'm good on that, man. Dude. Nah, you ain't. You want it. Nah, a friend of mine freaking tried to, like, freaking have his way with another friend of mine, and I was like, oh my gosh, did that really happen? Like, my boy told me that he kept freaking closing the door of the bathroom with her in the room with him and stuff. It was like, oh man, I don't know how that keeps getting closed and stuff. And I'm like, did that really happen? He was like, yeah. And then like, you know, he had to stay there with those two just to make sure nothing bad would happen. Like, so the guy ended up leaving eventually and stuff. Like, he hit the road freaking hammered. And my friend, he was there with her. And like, he was on the couch. And she woke up like half naked. So she was just like in a, a like a t-shirt that looked kind of stretched out, like she's been possibly ravaged, but she wasn't, and her panties. And she like walked into the uh, the bathroom, then walked to the kitchen, and walked back to her bedroom. But she noticed my friend on the couch, and she just like ran to her room and like slammed the door and like slumped against it, and waited around for a bit. And then she came back out and she was like, please tell me we didn't do it. She was like, no. She was like, oh my God. Yeah, she still drinks even up until today. I found it That's hilarious. just poor decision making, Junie. Dude, that has she... nothing to do with you meeting the right chick. <laughs> no, no, no. That's not. That, that, that's my, that's a friend of mine. I was I was not really interested in her like at all. She was a cool person, but, you know, she can be kind of bitchy at times. Um, and snide. Uh, freaking, as far as chicks go, I don't want to pick up a chick. Not like pick up, like, yeah, I, like I can definitely pick up a chick. No. Um, I don't want to happen to meet a chick that is not, like, on the same wavelength as me. It's like crucial interests could either make or break a relationship. You think about it. If a guy plays a video game, he's wrong. You think about that long and hard, he's wrong. He's inattentive. He'll prioritize everyone else before a woman. 
as opposed to like let's say a woman mind you this happened to me before if a woman is on her phone and stuff maybe it, it's the guy that was boring her and stuff you know maybe he's not doing this or that and blah 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 you know but factly speaking she's just not that attentive of the guy like my first ex she did that to me constantly I couldn't talk to her. Or you could just look at it like the way Souls looks at it and his his wife. How does he look at it? He looks at it like Oh, she I I know for a fact she looks at it as a way of at least I know what he's doing. He's not going around cheating on me. He's at home, he's playing video games, he's by himself. Yeah, but not everyone is going to look at it like that. Like, uh, some yeah, people... but maybe you will. Yeah, uh, I hope Oh, that's shit. Damn, that's high. But once you think about it, like, not too many people expand their horizons and their thought process that way. It's more or less like, you know, he's this, he's that, he's lazy and stuff. He doesn't want to do this or that. And it's like, crap. Can I just have some free time? This is what I wanted to do with a bit of my free time and stuff. You know, you you think about it. You shell out for a subscription. Like, let's say Final Fantasy. No, is Final Fantasy is on the table. Okay. $77 for six months. All right. You got all that time. 180 days to burn it. Plain and simple. All right. So, it's a problem the moment that you're actually on it and stuff. And then the moment I turn my back and stuff... Like, I'm, I'm yelled at for possibly meeting up with some chick that I happen to meet on Final Fantasy knowing good and dang on well. These people could be anywhere in the world possible. I go down the street and I get accused. You see, you see what happens here? That's what I had to deal with before. Well, well with my second ex. Like, a chick freaking hits me up and stuff and it's a problem. Just because I'm dating one person, I'm just telling her that this is what happened and stuff. And it's a problem just for a chick freaking messaging me and stuff. Even though she's like, you know, thousands and thousands of miles away, she still feels threatened. But I'm like, what? Woman, I, I, I share a bed with you, okay? Rather, you share a bed with me or something like that, whatever. I, I, I pretty much, like, we, we literally sleep together and we have relations. I get that. I provide for her food and whatever else in between. I bought her a car and she did not even get it. Because that's on her and stuff. Now, honestly, she's the kind of person that more or less makes herself the victim. And in her head, she tells herself that she's the victim and she starts believing it. And it's scary and sad. So the last time Well, that's like you, Stephanie, my ex. Oh, she did that shit. Remember she accused me of raping her? Uh, After she had slept with my friend? I want to say yes for the sake of pacing. It sounds familiar, but I mean, can uh, I want to say yes. She she told me that she or no, uh my friend said that they had sex and stuff and I I was like I, like, freaked out on her and him about it, and she started, like, taking drugs and, like, drinking, and she accused me of raping her in a hotel. Yep. Sounds familiar now. But, I don't want to have to walk all the way back. But, yeah, man, that, that mess just, it made me mad because, like, I know what I did for her. I, now, the thing about me, I'm so adamant about it. I don't want to throw anything that I do for anyone back in their face. You should know what I'm capable of and stuff. I'm good as gold. You know what I did for you and stuff. We don't have to make it public and I don't have to readdress it now, do I? It don't have to be that way. Like, it's, it's irrelevant. Unless they're asking, me. what have you done for me? Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. I'll, I'll phrase it as though, oh, let's ignore the fact that X, Y, and Z happen, blah, 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 you know, let's ignore that. That's at least saying, like, if you said that, what have you done for me? You already forgot, so we're ignoring it. Yeah, that, that, yeah, we can go that route. We can, we can go there all day and stuff, man. We can go in here and revisit it. We can bypass and stuff, because obviously you didn't give a damn. Yeah, I'll, I'll be that. 
But other than that, up front, I ain't going to say, oh, don't forget who did this and that, this and such, and blah, blah, blah. <laughs> okay. <laughs> what? Well, yeah, I'm not, I'm not going to be that person. No, no. Not, you, not, not what you're doing. Um, oh, okay. Lady Ugiri told me I had to steal an outfit from my uncle.